so I'm on 25 gamers. Um, it's been a little bit, been about a week since I've uh, been able to get a video out, and uh, I want to talk to you guys today about the update. I'm going to update the channel and kind of what's been going on with me, kind of my situation in the past uh, semester of college. Kind of recap. I ended up finishing up the semester of college last uh, last Thursday, and um, so I want to talk a little bit today about you know just kind of what's been going on with me. Um, so I'm just going to show some plays. I'm uh, just going to get some reps here in practice mode, but I want to, it's mainly just a commentary, uh, so don't feel like you have to watch, um, you may just want to switch to another tab and, and just listen, but, um, basically what's been going on with me, um, I had pneumonia in the month of November this year, and so I got a, I got diagnosed November 1st, and, uh, and then I went back for a checkup in later in November on Thanksgiving break, which was about the 20, 20th or so, and found out that I had, um, I had not necessarily uh, completely came out of the pneumonia, but I had done, uh, made some improvements, so I was cleared there. Uh, but then I found out that I have a double hernia, and uh, it was a double inguinal hernia, both were very low, um, and so I had to schedule surgery. And um, when I had to schedule surgery, it was kind of rough on me because I ended up um, uh, falling on December uh, 23rd, I believe, yep, that's today, or day we just got done, um, December 23rd, and I'm gonna try and get this video out to you on Christmas Eve, um, and, uh, so I just wrapped up the surgery, and I'll, I'll get back to that in just a moment, but, um, so we, we scheduled the surgery for then, and unfortunately I was redshirted, um, for my baseball team, uh, just due to medical reasons, um, the pneumonia, keeping me out for a month, and then, um, when it's going to wind up being about two more months worth of uh, recovery from the surgery. So it, it was just in everyone's best interest for being my freshman season to go ahead and get 100% healthy for next season. Um, just a little bit of an update on college uh, where I'm at. We just wrapped up our final exam and our final exam week. Ended up doing fairly decent on my final exams. Um, and that's kind of why I didn't po post a whole lot of content in the last couple weeks. Uh, I, was, I was really studying hard for my final exams, and uh, like I said, I posted a video about five days ago. Uh, I, mean, I believe that would be, what, midweek last week, and um, I had a couple of pretty hard final exams that I just didn't really study hard enough for, and so I wanted to just make sure that I was, just wanted to make sure that I was prepared for my finals uh, going into the uh, exam. And so that's what I did. I, I kind of put Madden and YouTube on a back burner. I actually haven't played, been able to play Madden in a long time. Uh, it's been about a month and a half that I've actually been able to sit down and, and really di uh, dive into the game. So, uh, but I am back, um, so somewhat back actually. Um, and we're going to get go into that in a little bit more detail right now. Um, but anyways, the final exams finished up pretty well. I finished up well with my first semester of college, so for those of you who are... Uh, wondering about that, and I uh, just wanted to let you guys give you a little update on my my college life. Um, again, I go to Johnson Bible uh, College, Johnson University, uh, which is a great school. And um, next thing I want to talk about is the hernia. Um, ended up finding out that I had two hernias. Like I said, both were relatively low. They were both in guinal hernias, but they were so low that um, it required um, three incisions instead of just one or two. So I got three incisions. Um, the surgery was this morning at 7 o'clock, and I was really going to try, and I was hoping that I would be able to get some video content out to you guys um, today, uh, but unfortunately I just I just really was not feeling that great after the surgery. I'm still really, uh, really, really sore, um, and I'm just kind of forcing myself to do this commentary because I, I know you guys expect, um, you know, daily videos, and, and that's what I, I bribe myself on to to try to get four videos out a day, and, and we are going to get back to that uh, shortly. Uh, hoping for my goal is to get back into 100% back into YouTube uh, the way I want to be in uh, January 1st. Um, my goal, and, and that leads me into my. Uh, well, let me wrap up my hernia discussion. Basically, I walked in, uh, I got my surgery done, and it took about four hours, and I got out of the hospital at about noon. Uh, I went in for the surgery. I had to report at six. AM, so I left the house at 5, and reported at 6, and was taken back for surgery at 7.30, and then again, like I said, was released about noon, so, um, 
that's what happened there. And like I said, you know, I'm not um, not too many complications actually went down. It was just mainly uh, right now I'm just really sore and uh, don't feel like I don't feel like sitting up at all. So that's why it's very difficult for me to make these videos. Uh, so I just want you guys to know that I am trying my hardest. Uh, and I'm not trying to, you know, slack off or anything. I just wanted to, to just to let you know um, that I, it's not because I don't want to make videos. Um, it's just because it's, it's physically been very difficult uh, for me lately with the hernias in general. I had to work through my hernias with my work-study program, and it's just been a mess. But hopefully now with the surgery finally being done, I can recover from the surgery and uh, be back to somewhat of a normal schedule. Like I said, by, my goal is to be fully recovered uh, as far as like being able to do basic generic daily things uh, is to be hopefully recovered by uh, January 1st. That's my goal. Uh, I don't know if it will happen or not, but I am very hopeful. Uh, my checkup is in January, is in early January as well. So that does it for my life update. Um, now let's talk about the channel. Um, what I'm going to do... Uh, oh, no, I do want to talk about the ebook first. I apologize. Uh, let's talk about the ebook. So, the ebook, uh, I wrote a guide. Uh, the original plan was me and Zboy365 were going to write a guide, and then I went through all this uh, personal life stuff and, and physical problems. And so, um, kind of put that on the back burner, really. Um, I actually have the guide somewhat almost ready to be put together. It's not, there's not a whole lot left to do. Um, but it will require it's more of like um, the idea just got to get in touch with Z-Boy uh, I know he's probably with his family for the holiday so uh, if I'm going to finish uh, if I'm going to release a guide or or if Z-Boy is going to release one of my guides I would expect it by early January uh, I would not expect it before then just because of timing issues and uh, wanting to make it really as good as it could possibly be for you um, the first guide I'm looking to release is a defensive guide for the current gen console and then uh, hopefully soon I will be able to purchase a next gen console, start working on some content for you for that. I know a lot of you guys are I really wanting uh, I really want next gen uh, console tips. And I will be honest, most of the offensive stuff that I run, uh, from what I've heard, works on next gen consoles. Uh, defensively, what I would recommend doing is blitzing with different stunts and slants. Uh, what I mean like that is blitzes like Will Punch Three Seam, uh, Mike Sam Crash Three. Um, Mike Sam 3 seen blitzes like that from the 4-3 playbook are, are fairly effective. Blitzes like Stink Pinch Zone or Sam Mike 3 seam or, or stuff like that. Stuff that we've done before. Uh, but you don't have to build on it. You just use those stunts. That's what I would recommend. Uh, something from the Big Nickel Bear, Crash 3, um, Storm Red, uh, Fire Green 3. All those different blitzes. And then uh, real quick, one other recommendation here for next-gen console defensively. Um, don't be afraid to just call a basic Tampa 2 defense. Guys, Tampa 2 is one of the most effective defenses on next-gen consoles uh, from what I've seen. Sorry, I can't talk as much as I want to in one breath because of this, uh, because of my surgery. Um, so that is the plan with the guide. Now onto the YouTube channel. Um, the reason that I haven't been able to post mu as much on the YouTube channel as I would have liked to is because of all the personal life issues and scheduling conflicts I've had over the last couple weeks. And, and part of that I take responsibility for um, not planning ahead uh, of time uh, for, for the worst case scenario with the hernia. I didn't think I actually, I didn't think anything was going to come of it. I just thought it was just going to be like a, you know, if you feel better, great. If you don't feel better, come back kind of situation. Uh, but it turns out it was a lot more than what I thought it was. Um, so that's just kind of the idea there. Like I said, uh, I do apologize for not being responsible and not being on top of things like I should have been. Uh, I do take full responsibility for that. As far as the comments section, uh, I know some of you guys probably have been getting on to me for the comments. I haven't been able to read comments. Um, YouTube.com changed their... Um, comment section kind of work around so basically we as we we YouTube directors we get our comments sent in differently than we used to so it's not as simple as me just going to my inbox and checking all my inboxes now I have to go to my email which um, it's not that hard honestly um, it's just a different thing and I haven't gotten used to it yet so like I'm used to seeing like YouTube messages saying hey you got a new comment here or you got a conversation here but as the email I get about you know I'll get all of my YouTube information, so subscribers, um, 
you know, upload upload statuses, different things like that. And so jumbleizing them with the comment section is it's a little bit hectic, and I'm still trying to get a little bit more organized in terms of how to handle that, uh, which is why I'm going to run this channel the way I'm going to run it for the next week, and then we're going to get back into the way we want to run the channel as a whole. Um, over the next week, I'm going to introduce a couple of new series to you. I'm not going to give you actual, like, you know, content from that series. I'm just going to give you, like, an introduction and kind of understanding why we're doing it, why I feel like it's important to cover, and also why I feel um, that it's beneficial to you. Um, series, uh, new series coming to the channel uh, over the course of the next couple of weeks. We're still going to have Scheme of the Week. We're still going to have Blitz of the Days. Um, we're still going to have Beginner Tips, Advanced Tips. We're still going to have all that. Um, they're going to be a little bit better done. I apologize for the lackluster um, tips I've been giving recently. Uh, I don't think they're lackluster. I think I just did them fast. And um, when you do them fast, you don't always explain all of the ins and outs of the playbooks. So I am going to try to do a better job of that. Um, like I said, uh, we're going to have a couple of new comment, uh, a couple of new videos to the channel. Uh, all of those videos will be introduced to you over the course of the next week. So, uh, for example, one of the videos that we're going to be introducing to the channel is the call of the week. And the call of the week is a discussion-based video that showcases a situation and what you would recommend in that situation. So basically, we're going to take a look at a, a different, you know, kind of like a Bill Belichick mind, mindset. We, we're prepared for everything. And uh, that's this is what we're going to uh, show you, like some different gameplay scenarios. You know, down two minutes, um, down by four with two minutes left, ball on the 20-yard line. What do you call? What's your mindset? That kind of stuff. That kind of mindset of the game. Uh, I'm going to put that in there. Another new series I'm pretty excited about is the film study series. Uh, a look at a call in the NFL, how it applies to Madden, and how we can learn from the success or mistakes of what we see on Sundays. Uh, one of the things, if you guys don't know, uh, if you go to Philadelphia Eagles, one of the one of the um, one of the videos that their website does is the call of the week, where basically it's just a, a kind of an interview type of show with Chip Kelly, uh, and basically what it's designed to do is showcase the uh, what I just said, uh, a call or a, a game plan type of scenario, which is. I think it's very beneficial for us uh, moving forward and Madden to kind of start to learn, um, you know, the head, the the head game that is Madden 25. And of course, I have some a bunch of new uh, stuff as well. I've been working on that. Uh, one of the things I've been working on as well is a Johnson University YouTube channel, uh, something that is kind of inspired by our my my college. Um, so. Uh, be on the lookout for that. If that ever, if everything ever comes to that, I got to get in touch with some of the professors and see if it, it's uh, if I can get it approved. But uh, it's going to be pretty cool if you guys are into, uh, you know, if you guys are into um, uh, ministry, uh, media ministry. Uh, I would definitely check out that new channel. I haven't uploaded anything yet, uh, but it is it's in the works. I'm I've got the kind of basic layout for it planned. I just don't have the. Uh, I just need to get the OKs. Uh, and of course the time management, I gotta figure out how I'm gonna do all of this stuff in the little bit of time that I have a day to play and record. Um, so that's kind of the basic ideas of what we're gonna be doing as a channel. Like I said, you know, next week we're gonna be going over, uh, we're gonna be going over some new content schedules. Um, when uh, when our content is gonna show, we're gonna have a, a video that's gonna talk about that. Uh, I would expect maybe one, maybe two videos a day over the next couple weeks. Um, and I might uh, do these in gameplay format. I might do them in something like you're seeing here, just a, a quick pra practice round. Uh, the main problem, guys, is with my... It's just going to kind of be what the Lord allows me to do with my surgery. Um, it's very difficult for me to set up for long periods of time. And that's kind of just where I'm at right now. So I wanted to let you guys know that I'm not abandoning you. I'm not... You know, I'm not... Um, I'm not trying to get on your nerves or, 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 you know, not give out good quality tips. It's just... For some reason, I uh, just haven't been able to do that recently just because of the time, uh, all the time I had to spend studying for my test, uh, which college finals are on another level. Um, and not just that, but, you know, I had a, a couple of issues with my car. Um, I had a couple of issues with my uh, with my schooling uh, in terms of attendance. Uh, not that I wasn't going to class, but that I wasn't getting counted for the classes I was going to. Uh, so I had to work that out. And then, of course, the surgery has not helped me in, in the slightest so um, that's kind of an update, and like I said, expect some more content throughout the week. Uh, I would probably plan on at least one video a day, but my goal is to uh, basically these videos again are going to introduce new uh, new content uh, series into the channel. So, uh, like I said, film study, uh, call of the week, badge take, offense one on one, defense one on one. 
different things like that that we're going to go over and we're going to take a look at and we're going to take a look at why I feel that they're important. We're also going to have a video discussing a mission statement of the channel, uh, what we're designed to do. I feel like I've gotten a little bit away of what I was originally uh, planning to do with this YouTube channel. I want to get back to the basics and the foundation of it and uh, I want to start bringing you guys better quality tips more consistently and uh, more effectively. Hopefully this little setback in the road these last couple weeks uh, you know, hopefully that does not uh, ruin your interpretation of, of who I am or, or what I'm about. Uh, I do apologize again for the lack of content. That's not like me, unfortunately. I just had a couple of really uh, extenuating circumstances that I didn't plan for in advance, and uh, I won't make that mistake again. So I wanted to let you guys know what was going on with me, uh, how the surgery went, how my recovery is going to go, and I also wanted to let you guys know uh, kind of my future plan for this week as well as... Uh, when the first year comes around, and then I also have um, one other thing I want to talk about um, before I get going. That is uh, online connected careers mode. If you're interested in doing an online connected careers mode with me, uh, I'm I'm perfectly okay with running uh, with being a commissioner. Uh, the one problem with the online connected careers mode prop uh, that I would face would be, you know, what an advances would be. I would probably assume that we would advance uh, every two days. It seems like a pretty common. Uh, pretty common advanced schedule and it does a pretty good job so that's what I would probably go with um, but if you're interested in an Xbox 360 online connected careers mode um, if the Madden tips online connected careers mode is um, is up already then I'm gonna try to maybe start my own but um, that's kinda if you are interested just let me know in the comments and if you could even more if you go the extra mile please and email me my email will be in the description uh, under my commentator information if you could do that that would be great benefit to me to kind of get your your information and I can get in contact with you and etc so guys once again I really appreciate all your patience and all your support through these last couple weeks um, I know that it has not been easy uh, expecting videos and, and them just not there's just no way I could get them out to you um, unfortunately that's just sometimes li the way life goes and that's uh, the lo that's the luxury of being on YouTube we get some flexibility in terms of how often you post videos being kind of your own boss so um, it is a it is a blessing in disguise I think a lot of good is going to come out of this at the same time I do apologize for my irresponsibility and lack of communication uh, over the last couple of days unfortunately that's just kind of the way life hit me and uh, I just want to put out this video to kind of let you know what's going on with me and hopefully you guys see my side of it thank you guys so much for your time appreciate it so much and guys if you're really interested in checking out what some of the new series are going to be lately uh, please do check out these uh, these introduction series uh, that's going to give you a nice beginning foundation of what we're doing um, so guys I hope you guys really look forward to the new year I know I'm looking forward to all the extra content I'm going to be able to provide over the course of the next couple weeks and uh, looking really uh, forward to introducing some of these new series and replacing some of the series that I thought you know we, we really didn't learn a whole lot in terms of uh, how to become a better Madden 25 player. Thank you again for your time and your patience. It's greatly appreciated. Please leave a like rating if you guys enjoyed this video. Also, guys, if you want to show your support for me, uh, just just let, leave me a comment. Let me know you're praying for me. I really appreciate that. Um, uh, you don't have, like I said, you don't, you're not obligated to do that in any way, but I, I do appreciate it when my own fans uh, do reach out and support me. It really means the world. So once again, guys, thank you for all of your uh, time and patience, and we'll see you guys tomorrow.